Hello everybody and welcome back to Third Age Total War and today we are continuing with the All Evil Campaign and I think we uh, had a at least one battle right about to happen and we're two years away from uh, being able to build our top tier buildings which I didn't even build like the mid tier buildings so that's not good but yeah we're about to attack get our first dwarf battle because they, they did ask for map information they asked for map information and uh, something else, um, a, tr a trade route, trade agreement, but I don't think that's going to last long. <laughs> they have a they have an army with two siege, I think a catapult and a ballista or two ballistas, right outside of the North Rune settlement. So yeah, um, it's kind of writing on the wall there. All right. Apparently, random shit happens. Random shit happens when I load back in. I don't know if that's a bug or something, but uh, we can just barely hit them. Um, oh yeah, catapult and a ballista, and then they got just a bunch of ground troops. We have no archers. We got javelins. This might get weird. Whatever, we'll try it. Yeah, I didn't really prepare too well for that. Uh, normally, normally what I do for dwarves, at least my old tactic, is to just sit there, have a bunch of fire arrows, and then just break their morale as soon as possible. But I believe one of their, one of their warrior, oh yeah, general snipe. The only problem is my light cavalry. Not so good with the general sniping. Or just like hitting units, let alone dwarven infantry units. I don't think they had any archers though. They do have, you know, siege engines. We'll have to get rid of those real quick. Um Well, th this is these aren't like late game dwarf units. Jesus fucking Christ. Um, is this the general right here? I can't see it. Yeah, this is the general right here. Um, warriors, warriors. Halberds, halberds. Axemen. So their only, on, their only range stuff are their, uh, siege engines. Okay. Um... We got the general right there. And it's just a captain that we can snipe him. Um. Hit the catapult. Um, if we charge in right on the side right here, we should hit the general. He should be one of the first guys to get hit with the charge. Oh, shit. Got him! Perfect. Uh, but now we gotta get rid of- we gotta get the- Okay, they're- they're shooting uphill, so it's not gonna be too easy for them. But we're not gonna be able to hit them very much because of, uh, our lack of archers. Um... Okay, you guys... Horse archers start focusing their warriors. Oh, their blisses are... Facing that way. Five lost. Well, we can hit those ballistas from the back. 
Ouch. Okay. Good thing we have them on spread out. Yeah, well, we're charging downhill over here. I really hope these horse archers are going to be able to do something. If, if we were playing into late game dwarf units, this might be real, really bad, but... You guys, you guys need to pick up the fucking pace. Jesus Lord. You're just charging. Fuck me. What a pathetic fucking charge. Okay. You guys. Hit the catapults. Oh, look at this. Yep. Forty-two, forty-two. Okay, all right. Okay, we'll just charge in with these guys, uh, and then we'll take the general back here, and we'll try and break these dudes. Oh, broken. Okay. Okay, so these these cavalry they did pretty good on that on those charges. We almost broke them. I didn't. We didn't kill too many. Finish those guys off. Um, they are wavering. Wavering. Broken good. We got their artillery out of the way. You guys charge into their back. Um, okay. Uh, where's oh, okay. These guys. Now we'll just have to envelop them. Only half the enemy force remains. And we got... They lose their will to fight. We got like a one or two throws left for that company. Oh, did they just use it up? Yeah, they did. Okay, whatever. Oh, they'll go around then. And we'll just have our guardsmen. And they're they're all dead. Okay, that was looking a little bit scary at first, but yeah, general sniping is the way to play this game. And our golden boys, they got they got hit decently. Nothing crazy. Uh, and then we'll have we'll have this light cavalry just run down the rest of this, and we'll get a complete stack wipe. And now, um, okay, that four left in there. You're good. You guys head over there. And they're broken. Charge them. Okay, you guys get out of the way. Okay. So yeah, uh, javelins are just really, really strong. They're good at, like, breaking morale, I think. Christ, we got lit the fuck up. Uh, okay, nice. Nice charge there, buddy. A 
foe fights with horns made of clay. We are winning the battle. Got him. Like children, scour them from the field. Yeah, that's what's called a absolute fucking victory. Okay, <laughs> that was pretty good. All right, so dwarf tactics are still looking good. Of course, that was a relatively small dwarf army, but pretty tiny, pretty minimal casualties. No. Yes. All right, you're done. And now. I think, actually, we'll leave, I'll leave these guys, I'll leave some clansmen in there, just to maintain public order. And, uh, because those javelins are pretty damn good. Plus one authority, plus one troop morale, that's really good. And three hit points, because dwarven armor is, like, strong, I guess. Okay, we need to... Oh, okay. Oh, that's way too low, yeah. Yeah, I need to just crank up taxes, um... Everywhere I can. Yeah, 85, yeah. Um, here, I guess I'll, I'll leave this on low until they upgrade, but... Um, population just isn't really worth it. Um, and if we go below 70%, then I think we need to lower it, but... As long as we... I could, well, for this place... We have to upgrade twice, though. Oh, 35, Jesus. 75 is good. Seventy. I think seventy percent is. You can leave it at. Uh, I, I'll play it safe. Roman. I, I'll leave Roman at low because I want to maximize population growth because that's like the only city that comes close to being able to train my uh, late game units. Seventy. I guess we'll. Yeah, we'll check that out. This place has always struggled with public order. I think high taxes. Yeah, fifty percent. But, um, do we have any... We can't get any more law buildings. But this should... That should help us with money. Which is gonna help us with more troops. I'm, I'm gonna need that. That's gonna be more important for Mordor, because Ruin always does pretty good with, uh... Money. Like, without me even trying. So... But maybe that might bite me in the ass. I don't know, because it might... The population might be worth more. Uh, fuck it. No, we'll go. Yeah, we'll go on high. That's 65. Yeah, we'll every everywhere we can. We'll go high. If we can handle the public order. And these guys, they cannot hit Darwinian, so we might be able to hold on to that. Um, yeah, it's not too big of a deal. And we got this army right here. Um. I think this is just tons of infantry. Yeah, if we again, if we snipe the general, that should make breaking them and like mass chain routes and make should make all that a lot easier. Um, if we smash this Dale army, we should be able. If I have enough, I should be able to just like move over or go right over to Rovenost and take that. Or I could I could take Wilderland here and then take this army and head up to Rovenost and then Arwa Ara Ara. That might. I uh, might have a garrison. I don't think this does. I know, I think all three of these settlements here have garrison scripts. No, this one right here doesn't. But these three, there's another one right here. And then we got... Uh, one of these is Dale and Esgaroth. I don't know what the fuck. But... Dale's up there, then... Long Lake. The point is, these three settlements, the last three Dale settlements have garrison scripts. Which, at that point, by the time I get there... R Rune should be too powerful to even... It shouldn't be... It shouldn't matter. And then this, the Iron Hills do not have a garrison script. I thought they did for, like, the longest time. But yeah, now we have, uh... We're at War with the Dwarves, and we have all the information we need on them. Where we know where all their stuff is. They, they seem to be the most powerful over here. But only one settlement over there is garrison scripted. And then four over here, I think two of these are garrison scripted. 
and Gundabads are going to be the only ones who can deal with this in like... By the time anybody else gets over here, we've already won the campaign at that point. All right. Let's hope nothing wild happened. Oh. Gundabad and Sylvans? It was a fair deal. Yeah. Good day to you. Ah, shit. They're gonna... Yeah, they're gonna knock out my ships. Get out of here. Fuck. Okay. We have two units of archers, a general. They have uh, no archers whatsoever. Okay. We have that advantage. Their general is with some dwarven miners. Um, oh boy, this might get a little bit weird. Uh... No, no one has any cavalry, though. Alright. We do have the capability of using fire arrows. But, uh, with how many guys they have, I don't know about that. We're, we're gonna have to snipe the general on this one. Um... Well, we're gonna defend. Defend on this hill. And then we'll have our spears right out in front. Then, uh, the general will have him over be over here to hold those troops. And then these guys, I think, are basically just effective against armor. There are two, um, two-handed weapons, so I think they're they're just better overall. We're gonna try and flank them with these guys, I guess. They weren't happy about that. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I forgot. Oh, okay. I have an extra unit of spears. Uh, okay. Well, the Snaga- these guys are for flanking. These two-handed dudes. Okay, the general's right here. They slowed down, are they having second thoughts? Light infantry... Oh, they have- oh shit. I think those are their javelins. Oh, they got two... Fuck, they got two of them. Um, well, that's pretty bad. Where's the general right here? Okay, he's right in the middle. And one one unit of wargs would like turn this around. I'd just be able to hit this general and then that'd be it. Of course, wargs might be absolute fucking garbage. Here we go, finally got them to turn around. At least some of them. Nope, oh, guess not.
Well, they just gave up the high ground like a bunch of fucking chumps. Axe throwers are right there. Where are these, where's the other fucking, where are these guys? General's right there, right in the thick of it. These guys are gonna get absolutely fucked, okay. Uh, yeah, this, this company is gonna be bait. You goddamn idiots. You goddamn fucking idiots. Get. Okay, they routed. Oh my god, no, fuck. What are you fucking, what are you fucking dumbass little midget orc fucks doing? They got fucked pretty good. Ooh, okay, I like that. Those guys finally routed, that's fine. They regained their composure. Um The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Their general? Is somewhere. I can't see him. Oh, their axe throwers flood. Okay, all of you engage those guys now. They all broke. All of you start lining up. You guys engage them, you guys turn that on and start shooting at them. You guys try and hit these guys in the side. Whoa, 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 it's still 103? What the fuck? The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Those are there's 30. Oh, they had two companies there. Try 
charge down that hill. Yep, they regain themselves. Okay. You guys line up there. Oh my god, what the fuck? Why are you- why are these all fucking- why can't you stay in a fucking formation? Fucking dumbass fucking orc tard fucks. Only half our force remains. Is this the general? Why aren't they fucking breaking? Where is the general? Broke all those fucking retards. Oh, what the fuck? Pussies. Uh, 83%. We didn't get the general. Uh, okay, that, no. That's gonna be a lot of friendly fire. Okay, um, 86%, 870, ooh, yeah, those losses are pretty equal. Under half the army, though. Well, two, two dwarven defeats so far. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Um, yeah, dwarves aren't as scary as I thought, I guess. Just gotta, you know, divide them up. Cut them down. Area door, don't do anything weird. Okay. Uh, I don't think I need any more commanders. Uh, where the fuck did you come from? Ah, another Gondor army, and it has a ballista. Harad, good. Dwarves and rune. Uh, these guys, okay. I want Malgalad back. And we need to... Crank taxes up everywhere because Mordor needs troops and we'll upgrade that. Um, that place is already upgraded. High taxes, we can't do anything else here. High taxes, 75% is good. I think, I think also the growth rate 
is the thing that fucks up with- is the thing that screws up Squalor. Oh, we can go very high taxes there, that's good. I think that's what fucks up uh, Squalor, or increases Squalor. But now, that's a lot of money. Not as much as I was hoping, but it's still money. Oh shit, why did I- well, it's, it's just a- Oh, four turns until we're done with this. Um... But yeah, we just need troops. I already have a ballista. Wow, I really fucked up. Yeah, I did not build any of the correct building. Any of the right military buildings, and now we're just like... Yeah, okay, we, I just need to save money. Um... Yeah, I don't care about this place too much. Um, get out of here. I uh, we have a spy all the way back here. Hurry up. Oh wait! Ready. This way. I am here only to fight thee. Get ready for fighting. Motherfucker. That was my opportunity. That was my opportunity to kill the to kill the army right outside the garrison to stack wipe it and stack wipe the garrison. That was my and I fucking attacked those guys. Oh no, wait, wait. Oh no, I don't have any ballistas. No sleeping here. Well, I'm retarded. Uh, yeah, that's that's all I got to say about that. No shit. Okay. Oh, it's down to forty percent. Christ. I, I can't believe it. I actually can't believe it. I can't fucking believe it, bro. What am I doing? What the fuck am I doing? Uh, that was the opportunity. I was I was talking about that. Yeah, last video. I could attack this. I could stack wipe, but they don't have very powerful units. Looks like one unit of cavalry oh, actually. Well, before I go run in my mouth too much. Okay, two units of cavalry, I assume full strength. And then their general cavalry, two ballistas. Fucking bandits? Two units of archers? That was my opportunity. That was actually the opportunity I've been waiting for the whole, like... Okay, I've been waiting for it for a little bit, but you get the point. Oh, perfect! Ready. This way. Yeah, and I should be able to. I should be able to hit him, and then yeah, if I. Ready. Hurry. I have and then if 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 we win this, well, I mean we're probably gonna win it, but um, when we stack wipe it, we should be able to take one Nazgul and just enter the city. Was that your best shot? And then they won't. Then we won't be have to worry about any of these. And then we will absolutely have to rush troops up there. Oh, I have to re... I have to redo... All my taxes. Thank god, I need to- I need to pay attention to that shit. Because that's like... So fucking important. And, uh, Nernan... I think that's all my cities. Yeah, there's a lot of- there's- ew. That's probably why Mordor struggles with money so much. Um, we'll take these guys, go over here, um, merge up with all these three. Probably- pro probably take the general out, leave some orc band in there. And then we'll go take Malgalad. Rohan shouldn't ha leave too much of a force there, it's literally just a village. Well, this will probably just swap hands back and forth because it's really not important. It's just more spite-driven horse shit. Alright, here we go. Kill them all. Okay. I guess they're not close enough. <sighs> okay. Whatever. You, I don't think- you don't have a choice in whether or not you can bring out reinforcements, I don't think. 
Oh wait, no, I didn't go. I didn't go to the right thing. I didn't go to the right um attack thing. What? What the fuck? I guess he's not close enough to the. Whatever. God damn it. I whatever, bro. Whatever. Son of a bitch. I guess I can leave these- no, I need the orc band up here as soon as possible. Um, where's the ballista? Oh, there it is. Um... I guess we can leave the ballista in Carandros. Whatever. That sucks, damn it. Why is he just- is he actually just not close enough to the settlement? In order for it to reinforce, I guess he is a little bit behind it. Ah, man. Ready. This. I am here only to fight Almost had it. Almost had it. Yeah, uh, Isengard absolutely needs um, money from these taxes. And we, we're the opposite of Mordor. All we have are, are cities. And we have very good public order. Um, this place, uh, if we run into a village, I'll just let that build up. Um, yeah, I mean, Rohan's got a big army somewhere. Hurry up. They're probably... This way. I guess they're not on the way there. Um, 2,000. Get ready for fight. Ready. Hurry up. I don't like this. Where's this their army? Way. Oh shit, okay. Yeah, we just we gotta always have a um army in Isengard. They had a really, really big army. Maybe they're maybe they're headed all the way over to Mordor or something. I'm not sure. Maybe they're doing stuff over here. Um, yeah, I might I might want to throw a spy over here. Um, Eriador still hasn't done anything. I guess. Um, yeah, where's an Eriador? I think there's one out here somewhere. Oh, oh, we found the border right there. I think. Um, I think there's an Eriador settlement somewhere over here. I want to try and get peace with them because they haven't attacked me yet. And we also, we got to pick up some more rebel regions. There's still a lot hanging around. There's still these two over here by Athelion. So yeah, we got to do that. Uh, leave, leave this guy in there. And these guys... We'll try and assault, um, the Gap of Rohan, try and take that. Depending on what settlements they have, that might make this safe. But if they want to go take that, I can probably take it back relatively easily. And we're losing 404, 404 gold, so it's not too much to worry about. I could use a watchtower over here. Um, there's a crossing right here. Well, I mean, I'm not sure where Rohan's army went, but oh wow, are they? Oh, are they just are these passing through? I don't care. That's fine with me. Sylvans can do Sylvan things. Crank taxes. Oof. Taxes. Uh, that's uh, gonna be that's gonna be done kind of soon. They are... That movement is crazy. Uh, well... <laughs> Shit. Do I... 
Oh, that's pretty... This makes me a good amount of money. 341 for that? Oh boy. Um, yikes. Well, it looks like this guy's headed for there. Um, this army's big and slow, but we should be able to make it... Should we make... Should be able to make it close enough to scare them off. We got another city right here. This... Oh, oh, Moria. Oh, we should be able to tax the fuck out of that. And I don't think uh, growth here, I don't think population growth affects the replenishment of units whatsoever. Okay, um... Do I already have the warg breeder? Oh, we need archers. Uh, 42... Oh yeah, still making good money. Skirmishers are pretty useful. Uh, we need ballistas. Can't, yeah, I can't really train anything anywhere, really, at the moment. Um, can't retrain that stuff. Probably don't have enough culture there. We got one spy here, one spy here. I always want one spy on these guys. Yeah, they're, they're just training more and more stuff. We're gonna have to uh, for, scare them out with Gundabad or somebody. And we got this place right here. Relatively small garrison, but it has the garrison script. But, uh, with my, with all my tactics and stuff that I'm learning with watching other videos, the, the garrison scripts might not be too crazy if I just play my cards right and take my time and be careful. Um, put these guys in there just to save that little bit of extra money. We got a bunch of snaga right here. But we should be safe to move around relatively freely, because I do have a guy right here. If they move out, I'm going to see it. So, yeah, we'll just try and consolidate all our forces to screw with the Sylvans. They're yeah, probably going to try and siege that, but I got this army on the way over there. This guy, it looks like it looks like he's headed through here. But we'll, yeah, we'll hide in there. And they can, they can just come in and take that if they want. There's no way I'm defeating this army with this. Um, they, yeah, the Sindar archers, yeah, I'm not, even with, even with, like, warwicks and stuff, I'm not gonna be able to general snipe the elves very easily. At least not a, uh, at least not a, a general. Actual dedicated general. If it's a captain, then probably. Alright. Wow, what the fuck is this? Jesus Lord. Uh, 36, zero command, zero respect. I don't even think I need a, a, the rings in Dale, okay. Well, I guess we'll guard the bridge. Um, yeah, a little bit of reinforcements, not much though. Oh yeah, uh, well this, yeah, we don't have much. That's pretty bad. Can't increase taxes there. I want to let that build up on its own. Well, ready. Hurry up. This way. Hurry okay, we up. should be clear. Get ready for fighting. Come on. To try and hit this. I'm not sure how that's gonna go. Um, 2,500. We... Ooh, wow, we suck. Oh! Okay, well... Let this grow. Let those final 500, um... Get in, and then we'll do that. Oh, shit, we can train some good units there. Uh, wargs. Spears. Absolutely. No sleeping here! A They're going for a settlement. Their other army fucked off, though. Unless it didn't. Okay. Kind of. I guess it did. I mean, if if I can defeat the dwarves with only infantry, I don't think Eridor is going to be too... Well, no. Eridor has cavalry, though. I can greet you, but not serve you, lord. 
think I might. Can I make a dip or train a diplomat? No. We need troops way over here to combat the dwarves. No sleeping here. Or move. How far can this guy go? Come on. I just want that army out of his range. I don't want my trolls to get touched. Well, yeah, he can't hit this army, but it looks like he he can hit Graham this turn. But and he'll be able to assault Graham this turn. I am a warrior, not an emissary, my lord. There is healthy respect between us, my lord. No sleeping here. Jesus Christ. Trolls should be good general snipers. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, that, that already, I think I already did everything here. Did it save? Does it save like right before you? Why did? Why did it come here? No sleeping here. I think I did everything. Same guy. Okay. So yeah, we need to get those guys into Graham. Uh, get these guys over there, because if they do attack, I want to be able... I, I'm going to actually need to try and hold that. Get ready for fighting. Come on. Um, that Dwarven army left. Looks like they got stuff over here. Uh, it doesn't look like they have too much stuff. I think I think that's the only settlement I can increase taxes on. Is Gundabad, but it should do something. And we'll just merge the army here. If I do that, we should be able to get a full company, then we'll try and retrain those guys next turn. Okay. Well, fuck Ariador. If they do that, fuck them. They're scumbags. The general. Uh, and now it's in the Hornburg, apparently. My ears are yours. I'm okay, I think this is our opportunity to go try and take some of this stuff. And also to kind of build up our forces over there. Um, I'll take this army and we'll go try and just like bulldoze or try and storm those two. And 4,000? That's not going to be... Ready to go anytime soon. Whoa. Okay, that's pretty bad. Yeah, we're lacking with the public order all around. Jesus, yeah, we can't even get to high with, like, some of these... Seventy percent should be good. I guess I'll find out when we get to Rune's turn. <laughs> Next turn here, or I guess half turn, quarter turn, or one sixth of a turn. Oh, these guys. Okay, finally ready there. Um, seventy percent. Anybody else at red? These guys are at red. They're at seventy percent. Okay. Now we should have... Ah, that's a lot of money. Yes. Okay, now, yeah, we need to train, train, train. Uh, I don't care about armor too much. Uh, I guess get some Corsairs. Some of those guys. Uh, we're still training 
cavalry there. And I don't think we're able to we can get another diplomat. Okay. And these guys just get the hell out of here. I guess we'll, we'll have to try and train up some more ships. That's annoying. But since Gondor seems to be kind of lacking over here right now, we'll have this guy just stay out here. Try and get some more troops over there, take this little army, and go take South Athelion at least. And if we can, if we got time, take North Athelion, or Central Athelion, or just Athelion. And then, hand both of those over to Mordor. And that'll give them one more city. But it'll also give them a border right here, so they'll have to defend that. But I get, since I got so much more money now, I think I'll have Harad just guard this crossing and this crossing. That's like two armies we gotta worry about. Alright. Now the general. One ring located where? Yeah, Hornburg. Okay, so I guess it was random. It just chose randomly. Oh, they sieged. Wow, look at this. It doesn't, it doesn't even tell me that they sieged. That's weird. Alright. Looks like these guys... Good. Um... You can build wall ladders here. Oh, wait, no, there's only one... Is there only one gate for a wooden castle? I think there is. Has the time come to strike? Order. We march. Well, they're getting right up in my face here. I respect you, my enemy. Yes. Uh, 52 minutes. I think I think we'll I think we'll start with some rune battles again next turn. Um 32 you're not making a whole lot of money. Oh, whoa! What the fuck? Okay, I went down to 65 for whatever reason, then then back up to 70. What's up with this place? Oh, that's what's up. Uh... Well, yeah, we need a barracks here. Yeah, now that I got that culture thing, now we need a barracks and the stables and everything else. Um, oh, we got oh, we got these guys. They can go straight there. And then we'll get them in this army. They should retreat if we... Yeah, they should just, like, fuck off. And then I'll probably... Three spearmen? I'll probably just ride that down next video. And they got another little group of dudes. Doesn't look like much at all. Uh, we got a spy right here. Ooh, another Dale army right there. Another set of three spearmen that are going to get absolutely demolished. Well, this is going to be a nice battle. Um, we got two generals there, that's really good. Two units of horse archers. We should be able to general snipe really easy. And then they got a... Uh, their own dog shit cavalry. And then a bunch of... These guys missile? They're javelins, okay. They got, yeah, just a bunch of infantry. Looks like, yeah, heavy focus on infantry. A one, two, three... Four units of archers. Yeah, it's a very good mix of infantry, but it's only infantry so if we attack one to one looks slightly in their favor but I'm, i've dealt with a lot worse than that but yeah uh it's gonna do it for this one so if you made it here thank you for watching if you watch any of my other stuff thank you for watching that as well and i will see you in whatever i decide to do next time so thank you for watching